Oh boy, did I maybe call this. Uh, if you check out the community form, I did post about how we kind of got ticket sales around this time last year and maybe it would repeat and boy did it repeat. Ticket sales have now dropped for Halloween Horror Nights for this year. Uh, this is unbelievable and we're gonna talk all about it in here. Try to scope out if there's any details in the fine settings if we can spot something. But yeah, so the single night tickets start off at the price of $79.99. And then we have the express ticket, which starts off at a whopping $109.99. That is per person plus tax. Obviously all of these are plus tax. Uh, the Halloween Horror Nights RIP tour, which I highly recommend it's if you're going to do Horror Nights for one single night, this is probably your best bet. Ooh, boy, this price is starting at $299.99. Uh, separate admission is required on top of that. So you have to have, obviously, your ticket to Horror Nights on top of adding on the RIP tour. And then we have the ever so popular and one of the best things I think about Horror Nights that you can do is the unmasking the horror tour starting at $119.99. And that price tag is actually for the three haunted house tour. If you chose to do the six house tour, it is starting at the price of $169.99 is for the price of that one. And be sure to book this as soon as you can because guaranteed these things sell out. They sell out really, really quick. What's noticeable is obviously we don't have the uh, character dining is not listed. So not quite sure if that's gonna be coming back or not. Uh, kind of interesting, that's not there. Uh, let's see, for single night's tickets, we're gonna do one. And the rumor about uh, Horror Nights being all the nights in October seems to be not true. At least as far as the single night's tickets, I can't see that there's Monday and Tuesday are all blocked out. Uh, there's no ticket choices for those nights. So that rumor is now put to rest for this year. Uh, we. Yeah, <laughs> I almost forgot to mention, also looking at the ticket date sales, we have it fully officially announced. Well, it's on the website, so I guess it's official. September 1st is the opening weekend of Halloween Horror Nights. So the first, the second and the third. So start booking your stuff right now. There you go. Tickets are on sale. That is pretty much it. I'm, 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 I'm assuming we're, we're right around the corner from our first not first, our second big announcement. I keep forgetting about Chucky. Jeez, I wish they wouldn't have announced it back then. But uh, yeah, let me know down in the comment section. Are you excited for this? Are you got your money ready or the ticket prices are a little too high? Leave it down in the comment section. Let's have some dialogue back and forth. And also check out the community tab because we're doing the best of Halloween Horror Nights 31. It is houses, zones, they're all mixed in the bracket. Some interesting stuff that's going on with the voting there. Uh, I, I don't even know who's gonna be the clear cut winner and crown the best of Halloween Horror Nights 31. So check out that one in our community tab. Also check out this video about maybe Blumhouse coming back this year. Maybe. <laughs>